You have the right to an attorney present during questioning. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed for you. Do you understand what these rights? What are you doing? Snelly no, 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 is a law-abiding citizen. Please, 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 you can't please. treat him like a violent criminal. Uh, perhaps the men of law have uh, mistaken my identity? No mistake, Mr. Smelly. We have evidence that you are a threat to national security. This way, please. <laughs> being accused of now. You made good on all those threats to keep Spinelli away from me. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, please. How many times have you told me that Spinelli is too dangerous for me because he works for Jason and he does all those things on the internet that might not be strictly by the book legal? A lot. Yeah, so I didn't listen to you and you had to have him arrested by the FBI? Actually, the FBI said they'd be using our facilities to process a prisoner. They never said it was Spinelli. Well, it is and it's awful. What happened? Spinelli and I were on the pier and these FBI guys came out of nowhere. They put handcuffs on him, they took his laptop down. He was scared out of his wits. You have to do something to help him. Actually, this is the FBI, all right? The federal government, do not, I repeat, do not get involved. Hey, Mr. Scorpio, we're bringing in the prisoner now. You. You did this to Spinelli. I thought you were a whack job, but you're really some undercover federal agent? Maxie, that's enough. This is a matter of national security. <laughs> I I'm most certain there's been a grievous error in judgment. This way. Spinelli, don't you say another word to those creeps! A matter of national security, Spinelli? This is insane. These people are lying. They're setting Spinelli up. I told you that's enough. Further discussions with the suspect will be private. Dad, please do something. You have to help him. I'm actually I'm sure the paperwork is in order. I'll have more information for you once I've interrogated the prisoner. national security. Oh! What now? Are you gonna file assault charges against me? Go ahead, use your badge to bully me like you did to Spinelli. The investigation wasn't personal. Spinelli thought you were his friend, and you took advantage of his kind and generous nature. Well, I have a feeling you did it before me. Yeah, I did, and I feel awful. But do you feel the least bit of remorse? I mean, with all the horrible people out there doing awful things, do you feel bad that you wasted your time targeting poor Spinelli? Are you aware of your multiple crimes, Mr. Spinelli? No, no, not at all, sir. Hacking into government defense systems, Interpol, witness protection data, high-level security files, and monitoring systems. Pretty intense stuff for the local computer whiz. I assure you, it was not intended to harm. It was espionage and high treason. Hello. Sam, it's Maxie. You have to help me find Jason. It's an emergency. And I've been arrested by the FBI. Oh, Jason. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. I'm sorry. Sorry. I wasn't spying on you. Um, I would, uh... Maxie's freaking out. Spinelli's in trouble. Can you please talk to her? Maxie. Ma Maxie. Maxie. Just, just calm down, okay? And tell me, tell me what's going on. Spinelli was arrested by the FBI. They're in the interrogation room right now. The, the senior agent, some guy named Rayner. He's obviously grilling poor Spinelli. Looks like a deer caught in the headlights. You have to do something. Okay, I want you to call Diane, and if they let you in to see Spinelli, I want you to tell him to say nothing at all, and I'm on my way. Hurry, please. Yeah, I'm gonna fix this. That was quite a promise. Yeah, Maxie said something about Agent Rayner. He wants he wants me to cooperate. I don't know what he would have on Spinelli. Oh, damn it. What? Well, it's just that Spinelli came over to my apartment the other day and I tried to warn him because Rayner had mentioned his name, but he couldn't focus because somebody hacked into his computer. Somebody hacked into Spinelli's yes. computer. Well, if it was the FBI, they have all the evidence they need. I, I did not intend to trespass on the federal ones. Mr. Spinelli, I'm going to give you a piece of advice. Say nothing and admit to nothing. The seat you're in is hot enough as it is. Don't make it any hotter. Oh, Diane, I was just about to call you. You have to help Spinelli. Do you know exactly what he's been charged with? Treason or espionage or something crazy like that? If you know Spinelli, he's going to try to explain it away in his convoluted Spinelli speak, and the feds are going to think he's confessing to hijacking the space oh, shuttle Maxie, or something. Maxie, just calm down. I will do the best that I can. I just got a call. What is going on? I just got a call. There's a suspect in custody. And the FBI took jurisdiction? 
grounds do they have for arresting Spinelli? Violation of the Homeland Security Act, treason, and espionage. Oh, well, <laughs> come on. Not to put too fine a point on it, but Spinelli would be hard-pressed to hurt a fly. That's true. Which is why I suspect he's merely a means to an end. Even you have to admit Spinelli's a wonderful person. I do admit it. But he still broke the law. What Spinelli does isn't criminal to him. He loves that cyber stuff. He's a genius at it. And when he's behind his computer, he feels useful and important. There's no malice or evil intent. And now he's in there scared out of his mind because you took advantage of him. This was my first field assignment. I did not know this was going to happen. I don't care. Spinelli would probably feel better if he could see me. You should arrange it. I can't arrange it. Look, Spinelli is in real trouble. And unless someone pivotal comes forth on his behalf and makes a deal, he's going to end up in prison, maybe for the rest of his life. I have to hand it to you, Mr. Spinelli. Our own tech experts couldn't have pulled off half of what you did. Any, anything I may have accomplished, hey, I simply... What did I say about keeping quiet? I don't understand it. If you do not wish to squeeze a confession out of me, then why am I here? I assume that the FBI is hoping that this is going to lead to a conviction for Jason, but it could be argued that anything on Spinelli's computer is his own work and does not implicate Jason. My guess is they're trying to persuade him to testify against Jason. Uh, I doubt that Mr. Grasshopper would ever consider such a thing. You're his attorney. Maybe you should let him know it might be in his best interest. Good luck. Where's Spinelli? He's in the interrogation room, Jason. Who you are and what you do, I don't think has ever been real to Spinelli until this moment. How bad? How bad it's is this? bad, Jason. The FBI alleges that Spinelli has hacked into multiple law enforcement databases, uh, defense grids, tax returns, you name it. The list goes on. Okay, do they have proof? If they do, then Spinelli may very well be beyond our help. Spinelli, are you okay? Step back, please. You, he's not a criminal. What you have to let him go. You can't do this, Diane. Tell him he's innocent. Miss, you're interfering with a federal investigation. I'm not just going to stand here and let you guys lock up my friend. Maxie, let it go. Mr. Morgan, we need a private moment. Not without benefit of counsel. Come if you will, but it will be better for Mr. Spinelli if your client confers with me alone. I do. It's, it's okay. I fear your optimism is completely mistaken. No, 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 but Diane is here, and she's the best attorney around, and Jason promised no, no, he was going to fix it. Even Stone Cold cannot swear the federal ones. I'm scared. Have a seat. You arrested Spinelli to get to me. That's right. And make no mistake, Damien Spinelli's freedom and quite possibly his life are on the line. Unless you do exactly as we say. <laughs> 